hello guys hope you are doing well uh, today i come up with the next tutorial video and this is my own research org of the uh, drinking water quality parameter which uh, in this table you can uh, see there uh, the weightage value of every parameter and this weightage was given through the uh, WHO uh, guideline for the drinking water you can see here so here are the categories uh, you have to set these categories with the uh, upper and the lower limit uh, given by the WHO standard and we can give uh, them to the weightage value like one two three and then uh, this weightage value uh, we can plot in the GIS to know the uh, drinking water quality of your uh, sampling site and all over uh, you can make any special map uh, and show the drinking water quality level uh, with the sampling points so these are the sampling points of uh, this uh, research area uh, of the winter and the post monsoon sample uh, so i have already made the uh, that uh, special analysis so this is the special analysis map so i will first categorize it with the uh, in, with the who guideline categories which i made for giving the weightage value so i have only made the three categories with the upper limit and the lower limit of the chloride value So you can classify it with going to the properties layer and on the classification so you can also can change the color ramp so here you can uh, add the chloride value uh, with the three categories which you have present here with the weightage value uh, which will present uh, that in the legend area so now you can insert uh, the legend of uh, here post monsoon you can go to the legend properties and select the chloride only you can set uh, the legend as per your need or as per your wish now for the next uh, chloride of the winter uh, again uh, go with the same process go with the properties and with the classification we have made the three uh, classifications here uh, for the three categories or the three weightage value that is one two and the three so you can again uh, here edit that value you can click ok so again for these uh, this is for the winter uh, you can provide the chloride with the unit and the value you can okay now again for the winter season you can again go to the legend properties Uh, here you can see here uh, put uh, insert of the chloride So here now the special map for the uh, winter and the post monsoon of the chloride water quality uh, has been prepared. Now we'll go through the uh, each sampling point 
uh, where we'll recognize in which weight is value uh, it represents here so we already have uh, the chloride uh, value uh, from the chloride value we have prepared the weight is value from that chloride value uh, within the in within these uh, three categories so i've already uh, put it in the excel for the here you can see for the sample one that is of the two and for the sample two that is of the one likewise we have made the all the chloride um, uh, all the sampling point chloride value with the uh, different weightage so i have made the three color here for the first uh, weightage value i have the purple color likewise for the second there is of the blue and the for the third and that is of the green so we'll uh, make this uh, you know, this sampling point with the those color with the uh, chloride value and the chloride weightage value so now go to the uh, properties of the sampling points now you can go to the symbols here and we have in the value field uh, select the SN or you have what you put uh, with the sampling points now uh, one by one you have to change the color of the sampling point uh, with the weightage value um, for, for the one uh, we have made the purple color now I have already told or mentioned it earlier so you can again see it in just like one you can see purple blue and green color so now we'll change uh, thoroughly step by step of this sampling point with the chloride weightage value so for the symbol you can use any symbol as you prefer you can make the different symbol for the different weightage value as well which can be easily recognizable so for all the sampling point you can go it's with the weightage value and uh, since the different color and the symbol here for the uniformity as you can clearly visualize which weightage value of the sampling point with the chloride um, value and the chloride for the drinking water that would be the suitable or not So after finishing all the sampling point you can click there ok now So there you can uh, see in the map that uh, the sampling point color has been changed. Likewise, uh, in the similar pattern, pattern um, will do it for the post monsoon here. Again, uh, we have already uh, categorized the weightage value for all the sampling point with the chloride value. So we'll go thoroughly with the each point, each sampling point and change the symbol color to make more representative uh, uh, map so here again you can go with the, these three color here with the weightage value
step by step you can perform all these sampling point and change the color so i have here with all together 35 sampling point and this is of the groundwater sample and we are trying to resource the groundwater quality status So now for the um, both season of the winter and the post monsoon we have already made the special analysis with the sampling point water quality of the chloride so the map was prepared so now you can export this map you go with the file then you can save it in the jpg file you can see that map so this is the map of the chloride uh, similarly we can perform the all other parameters of the water quality parameters to know the sampling points uh, which is value for the different water quality parameters with the special analysis so hope you like this video